Hello there. Welcome to Learn English with KMD, a platform where learning English and speaking English is made much easier. I'm back with yet another fascinating and thrilling video. In my today's video, yes, you hit the nail. I'm going to talk about a new idiom. Time to dive in today's video and time to talk about today's idiom. In my today's idiom, I'm going to talk about a new idiom and the idiom I'm going to talk about today is in unison. Yes, you heard me correct. I'm going to talk about an idiom in unison. What does in unison mean or what does it mean? In unison means all together or together. Yes, you heard me correct. In unison means all together. The meaning of in unison is all together. Let's try to comprehend the meaning of this cinematic sentence with a couple of examples. Here comes example number one. In India, Muslims, Hindus, Christians, Sikhs and people of all other religions live in unison. Yes, you heard me correct. I'm talking about India and in India, Muslims, Hindus, Christians, Sikh and people of other religion live in unison. They live all together. They live together. Well, my chest swells with pride when I call myself an Indian. I'm proud to be an Indian and so are all you people out there. Long live India and long live Indians. Moving on to the second example. Example number two. National anthem is sung in unison. Yes, you heard me correct. My second example is national anthem is sung in unison. National anthem is sung together all together as far as national anthem is concerned you know it's written by gurudev rabindranath tagov national anthem is sung in unison national anthem is sung all together irrespective of caste creed color gender or religion moving on to the next example example number three in joint family all the family members live in unison yes you heard me crack i'm talking about joint family in joint family all the family members live in unison all the family members live together as far as joint families are concerned you know in this day and age joint families have become a rare phenomena whereas nuclear families are mushrooming in every nook and corner a pity joint families have become a rare phenomena and nuclear families are mushrooming in every nook and corner moving on to the next example if we are going to delhi in unison tomorrow we are going to delhi together tomorrow do you fancy to come with us do you like to come with us do you wish to come with us moving on to the last and final example example number five this place is overcrowded stay in unison otherwise you will get lost yes you heard me correct this place is overcrowded stay in unison otherwise you will get lost stay together otherwise you will get lost hope you got the meaning of this idiomatic sentence in unison which means all together and before i take your leave i've got to make a humble request to all the people out there who are watching my video please press the like button share my video with your kids and kin and don't forget to subscribe my channel by pressing the bell icon at the bottom right over there so that you keep getting notifications right away when a new video is uploaded on my channel if you have missed or forgotten to watch my previous videos you can find the link in the i button do take a very good care of yourself and step out of your house only when it's absolutely necessary thank you very much